What if you could add a quarter of a century to your life by simply taking a pill? Sounds like an <laughs> infomercial pitch. But that's exactly the kind of pill a team of St. Louis researchers is trying to develop. Tonight in the Fox Files, Paul Shankman shows us if living longer could be just a swallow away. Trying to defy old age is an age-old desire. I go to the gym at least two or three times a week. You have to eat properly. Keep active. All good ideas. But what if you could live a long, healthy life with a lot less effort? Well, researchers at Washington University think that potential might be in this pill. If now our average lifespan is about 75 or 76 years, this could add another 25 you know, years of life it's, if it's extremely successful. What they are testing is a naturally occurring substance called resveratrol. It's found in red wine and it's a powerful antioxidant. So powerful, researchers at Washington University are studying whether large doses of resveratrol, and by large, we mean the equivalent of hundreds of bottles of wine in a single pill, can help people live longer. And to find out, they are testing it on people. So if it does work, uh, not only will they live longer potentially, but they will feel better by preventing the onset of diseases that will make them feel bad. While studies of resveratrol have already shown encouraging results in lab animals, researchers already know of a proven way to substantially slow the age process without drugs. 130 calories. It's called calorie restriction a diet of only 1,200 to 1,500 calories a day. Now, as part of its resveratrol study, WashU is putting volunteers on a calorie restriction diet so they can compare the results to the group taking the pills. We don't eliminate any food group. Volunteers Bernice Birmingham and Gay Olgus immediately noticed the diet's drawbacks. I was like, oh my gosh, I'll never be able to do this. You know? Sometimes at four in the afternoon, I'm going, whoa. You know, this is not going to work. Another study volunteer is Jennifer Vago. She chose the pill part of the study instead of the diet. I'm Italian. I like food. <laughs> I eat food that I like. So for 12 weeks, Jennifer is taking one pill a day, though there is a 50-50 chance she's actually getting a placebo. Feel any different? No. <laughs> any other changes in your health? Resveratrol is not supposed to make Jennifer feel any different because if it's working, the effects would be metabolic, so researchers would look for changes in things like her cholesterol and blood sugar. And while the idea of living longer by simply taking a pill is appealing, as a nurse herself, Jennifer finds it a little hard to swallow. I think that there are a lot of things that sound too good to be true, and we're just going to see whether this is or not. The hope by this research would be is that maybe by just taking the dose of this pill, which is a naturally occurring compound, we can make ourselves healthier and live longer without having gone through the more difficult part of reducing our calories every day. Testing done on fat mice found resveratrol did extend their lives by reducing heart disease, liver disease, and increasing their stamina. What works on animals, however, frequently does not work on people. But if it does, it could become the real fountain of youth. If it is, will you be taking it? If it is, I'll definitely be taking it. <laughs> With a glass of red wine? With the, maybe two glasses, actually. <laughs> For the Fox Files, I'm Paul Shankman.